I'm working on two projects currently. The first project is called The Rules of the Game. When I was working uh, in the UK, I came across quite a number of uh, commentary by the Europeans. They were worried about the fading power of the West uh, to set the rules of the game for international politics. Each time, politicians like Barack Obama or Angela Merkel from Germany uh, talk to the uh, leaders of China, India and so on. They talk about the importance of rising powers playing by the rules of the game. So uh, what exactly are those rules? They are never really specified. So I thought uh, it would be good if someone uh, came forth to write a book about those rules. Let me give you an example or two. We got to specify who the players are. This is a big debate within uh, the international affairs or relations community. We actually disagree on who are the most central players, in which I argue that uh, states are still the main players, but do not neglect non-state actors. That means multinational companies, uh, international civil uh, groups, uh, NGOs, uh, and so on. So that's rule number one where I specify the players. And then other rules include things like uh, some states are more equal than others. The second project that I'm working on, which is also a book-length project, is called the American Tributary System. America has created the most successful tributary system the world has ever seen. I argue that America wants, first of all, to be recognized as the power, uh, the number one power in the world. And secondly, it wants others to emulate its political ideas and institutions, i.e. Uh, democracy, liberal democracy. So the whole book will be dedicated to trying to argue uh, these propositions. In fact, I taught a class last semester, the semester that just uh, went by on the topic, and it was fascinating because I gave the students a chance to uh, discuss the rules with me and even to come up with those they should drop from my list and to include some that uh, you know, they thought of themselves. And I actually learned uh, quite a bit from them and they uh, from one another. 